Hey everyone, so sometimes I got asked about how I use Beatball, so、uh, let me share a story from when I couldn't solve easy level questions. So I hope my strategy proves beneficial. Step 1 Don't spend too much time for one question. It's crucial to independently come up with solutions, but if you find yourself stuck, try not to spend too much time on one question. The key is to keep going, so allocate a reasonable amount of time without going to dislike lead code. In my opinion, consider spending around 10 minutes on easy problems, 15 minutes on medium problems, and 20 minutes on hard problems. So, if you cannot think of a solution during that time, take a look at my YouTube channel or explore a solution from others. So, there are also、um, solution tabs. So, it might be a good idea to have a few trustworthy people from a solution tab. Step 2 When considering solutions, it's helpful to write down your thought on paper. After reading a problem, many people immediately start thinking about how to code a solution, but、um, it's not a good idea. Instead, they should first focus on algorithm without coding. It's obvious, but those who cannot explain algorithm cannot code. When considering algorithm, it's effective to try writing them on paper. This is because people who pass coding interviews always explain their thought before coding. So, in my opinion, I believe that while coding is important in the coding interviews,、um, the thought process is even more critical. From my experience,、um, I've passed interviews、uh, despite coding not going smoothly. The ability to draw diagrams and explain to others is necessary. Step 3 Solving questions of the same data structure consecutively. On my channel, I solve the daily questions provided by Lead Code, but it's actually not the best method to become proficient at solving the problem independently. When I started with Lead Code, I also attempted the daily questions, but I struggled with most of them. So, I began solving problems for each data structure starting with arrays. By consecutively solving problems on the same topic, I realized that there are patterns to be discovered. Recognizing these patterns increases the number of problems you can solve. This requires diligent self understanding. On my channel,、uh, there is a playlist organized by、uh, data structure, so I recommend starting with easy level problems and、uh, progressing through the topics. Since the quality of all the videos is actually poor, so I plan to re record good problems organized by topic in the future. Here is a recap of the three strategies. Step 1 Don't spend too much time on one question. Step 2 When considering solutions, it's helpful to write down your thoughts on paper. Step 3 Solving questions of the same data structure consecutively. Yeah, so I hope they prove helpful to you. I would be delighted if you could leave a comment. Yeah, so I'll see you in the next question.